hello everybody and welcome to this video on how to do facial animation using shape keys in blender so to do this we are going to select the mesh that we are going to modify with and in this object data panel we can s uh, add the basic shapes for this model by pressing this plus icon on this shape key step then we are going to add the another keys for the closed eye animation and we can rename this to closed eye and press enter then we going to enter the edit mode to edit the eye or just simply pressing the tab on the keyboard then we are going to make the eye closed and we can exit this edit mode by pressing tab and in here in the shape keys area we can see the closed eye have a zero value uh, as we increase this value into 100 the eye is going to be closed and when we decrease the value into zero the eye is going to be open and we can add another shape keys to make the mouth open and we can rename this to open mouth press enter and we can press tab to enter the edit mode and a to deselect everything and in this vertex select we're going to edit this mouth by pressing the vertices by selecting the vertices and to modify it to make this mouth open sorry uh, we can use this face select so that it would be easier and we select this lower mouth then we can go to uh, we can press 3 and 5 to the side orthographic view and we can press here to move this 3d cursor on the jaw area and we can press uh, we can select this into to move the pivot point into 3d cursor like this and we can press R to rotate to make the mouth open I think it's look fantastic and we can press tab again to exit this edit mode and we can change the pivot point back again into median point and in here in this open mouth key uh, we can see the value is at zero and when we increase the value into 100 we can make this character mouth open something like this we also can add another shape case for <coughs> for various expression and also also for the eye because I didn't have a separate mesh for the eyes so this character is almost cannot I don't know how to say it in English uh, the eyeball moving so in this particular model to do it we are going to 
separate the eye mask from this head mask by pressing this edit mode and select this eye face and press P and remove this into selection okay and when we exit this edit mode press tab now the eye is separate mesh and for this eye we can edit it to make the some changes by pressing the K on the keyboard something like this also for the other eye then we exit edit mode and we are going to add uh, we are going to remove this other shape keys from the eyes and we are going to add a new shape keys and rename this to eye right press enter and we entering the edit mode to move the pupil the eye into looking at the right side something like this Okay, now we can press tab to exit the edit mode and as we change this value we can see the eye moving and also we're going to add another keys for the eye left press enter and we're going to edit the eye so that it look to the left side something like that okay we can press tab again to exit the edit mode so when we change this value the eye is looking left but it's in the weird way so we're going to edit this something like this then we can combine this back again into the original mesh by pressing this I mesh and then press this uh, body mesh the head mesh and press control J so that it's now uh, become one for in this uh, body mesh and in here we also the value of the eye movement is also enter in this shape case for this body mesh and as we can see here the eye right 
and the I left also on the open mouth and close it eye to animate this facial expression we can simply uh, change the value uh, such as the eye close uh, we can press the eye on the keyboard uh, to set the key and we can move this um, timeline I don't know what this is uh, we can this into the frame into frame 20 for example and we can press I again to set this the keys and we can move like 3 frame and we can increase the value to make the I close then we can press I again here to set the keys for the animation and we can move again into another 3 frame and we decrease the value and press I again to make to set the key on the timeline keyframe so when we play back the animation you can see the eye blinking something like that and also for the eye movement we can set the eye and press I on the eye value like this and you can move like 4 frame and change this value press I again to set the keyframe and we can make it a little bit longer press I and then can move forward into fourth frame and decrease this value into zero and press I so it's something like this okay that's it for this tutorial and I hope you understand anything I say because English is not my primary language and I'm not really know that much about Blender so thank you for watching and see you again hopefully bye bye